Stephen, a difficult one today. How do you reflect on the game in general? Well, I think we're well beaten. You know, uh, in a strange way, though, we, we managed to get ourselves back into a game that we were miles out of. You know, so I suppose the disappointing thing is when you get yourself back into the game, the ease at which we then almost presented the game to them again. Um, but listen, they were better than us. You know, that's no bones about it. The first half, particularly with the older ones playing, you could see their game knowledge and their, you know, the way they managed the game, just their strength. Everything just, you know, was far better than us. So that's probably as young a team as we've had this season as well, you know. And I was almost wanting to say to them, I was just wanting to see if we could learn a little bit more about their character today. And when it went to 2-2, two, two, and it went 3-2, two, 4-2, two, and on, I seen some things that I wasn't happy with, with people's character and 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 and, and, and you know, probably how they conducted themselves in the last kind of ten minutes. I haven't had to say that too often, um, but in general, it was a game that, as I say, we got back to two-two somehow, and then you start to believe you can actually win the game. You know, from a position where we looked miles away, um, but ultimately we lost the game uh, and we just deserved to win. So the way you must be able to take some positives and some negatives from this, especially that immediate response at the start of the second half, but then as you say. As the game wore on, it was maybe perhaps a bit negative. Of course, yeah. You know, it, as young players, it's all about character building. You know, I, I said them at half time. Football is a weird way sometimes that it presents opportunities to you. And I think when we got back to 2 1, that was the opportunity I was talking about. It presented to give us a chance to get back in the game. And we showed lots, you know, lots of heart, you know, to get back to 2 2. But then it's how you manage the game after. I just thought we looked vulnerable today defensively. I thought we were very open. You know, we worked quite a lot on 1v1 defending and, and, and 1v1 drills. And four of the six goals came from 1v1s. You know, so it's stuff you have to go back and keep doing and keep doing. But, you know, when you lose your kind of better players out of the squad, you know, David's been, David Turnbull always in the first team, which is the most important thing. You know, he's been there over the past two or three seasons. And Barry Maguire, Christian, uh, Christian is, is a guy who have probably been with us, you know. So it was an opportunity for some people to show what they could do today. And I think they let themselves down. There's no doubt about it. But it's a game of football we've lost. You know, the reality is, you know, there's more important things going on in life, but in their life at this moment, it's about football and about progressing and, and trying to be better than what they are. So today was a steep learning curve for them individually, but for me watching them as well. Certainly, uh, you're not used to tasting defeat, particularly this season. So what's the message and what do you hope the boys take from this moving forward, Craig? Um, well, it shows that we have to improve. You know, it shows that underneath the, you know, the, the squad that we have needs to be better. The ones who aren't playing as much or ones who get opportunities presented to them have to be ready. If there's ever a day where you know you work and you know you talk about the physical aspect of it, how you live your life and you know how you eat and sleep and you know what you put in your body, it's days like that when the boys look a little bit tired and fatigued, are they doing the right things? Um, technically, we have to get better as well. I think tactically as well. You know, there's so many things, everything loose really. You know, you're right. We haven't tasted defeat very often, um, so we just have to get on with it. Uh, it's disappointing. Um, uh, yes, we're annoyed, but we go back to the training pitch and we work at it as we always do.